morning guys happy wednesday when you guys are watching this friday when i am filming it welcome back to my channel my name is maddie if you guys are new here hi i make a ton of fitness and lifestyle related content i own two businesses i'm a fitness influencer i love making content of just behind the scenes of what my days are like as well as fitness related content so in today's video i'm going to be doing a full in-depth upper body workout i'm doing a push day so a little bit of shoulders chest and triceps last week i did do an in-depth quad day of just kind of how I programmed a leg day. If you guys want to go check that out, you guys can click down below. I will link it in the description box. It is on my channel as well, but this week I wanted to do an upper body one. So I'm be showing you guys how I perform and program upper body workouts. Like I previously mentioned in my last video, my split is a little different now. So I'm doing lower upper rest, lower upper rest. So my rest days vary every single week. So I'm excited. Things kind of had to be switched up this week. Um, I have a lot going on this weekend. I have some photo shoots for my brand. So I had to be flexible and switch some of my days around which is fine so I'm excited I'm ready to get this workout in I'm getting my pre-workout and stuff all ready but of course I'm gonna show you guys the gym fit because I cannot not show it to you guys so this is today's outfit rem back there just chilling um so full outfit is buff bunny collection this is a buff bunny sports bra I think I don't even know what sports bra this is honestly under under pressure sports bra maybe um but it's the higher support one with the adjustable straps and adjustable band shorts are the are these the wave shorts or I think they might actually have like a new name but um they're the shorter version of the like Loch Ness legging shorts um and they just look like this Buff Bunny collection is the full fit and then shoes are just my white Adidas and I'm wearing black socks because literally all of my white socks are in the wash so that is today's fit I'm gonna get ready to get in the car and head to the gym I will see you guys when we get there and I'm gonna record everything I'm excited to bring you guys along so, let's get into today's video. Alright guys, time to go get this lift in. All right, guys, we are starting this workout off with some dynamic warm ups. So, I'm doing some arm circles here, as you guys can see with my long resistance band. You guys can get this on mydittlerfit.com, linked below, of course. This is just a medium resistance band, doing some rotations just to warm up my shoulders, some pull aparts as well. And then you guys will see that I go into some upright rows. Love using my resistance band for all of my warm ups, both upper and lower body. So, definitely recommend going and getting yours. So we are going into our first exercise, which is going to be some seated shoulder press. I normally start off with a light weight, like 20s, just to warm up. I normally do one to two sets of these going for about like 15 reps, I would say, just to get my body warmed up and get ready to go into my heavier lifts. I always start off my workouts with a compound movement. So this is going to be my main compound lift of this entire workout. And you guys will see that I'm going to be going up in weight. Um, I didn't record every single set that I did, but I do tend to do about four working sets of eight to 10 reps. So I do have my two warm up sets, which are the lower weighted shoulder press, which is about 15 reps each. And then I go into my working sets, which is going to be four sets of eight to 10 reps at a heavier weight. So that'll be about a total of six sets total. Um, so that's just what I find to work best for me. This helps me get warmed up and make sure that I'm really pushing myself incorporating progressive overload um, and I'm really struggling with these reps as you guys can see and then I have one more set going heavier as well so this is going to be my main compound lift and then we're going to be going into the next shoulder exercise Okay. 
Okay, I lied. The next exercise is not a shoulder exercise. It's going to be a chest exercise. I did flat bench with just some dumbbells. I go back and forth between doing bench with um, a regular barbell or just dumbbells. Today I was kind of filling dumbbells. So I did three sets of 10 to 12 reps at a like moderate to heavy weight, I would say. Um, I want to say I stuck with like 25s and 30s this whole time. Um, so I, you know, definitely pushed myself. But I always go back and forth between doing just bench press with the barbell, like I said, or dumbbells. Kind of just depends on on what I'm feeling if I'm doing shoulder press I normally tend to do dumbbells just because I am focusing on shoulder press being more of my main lift something that I can really focus on going heavy and progressing with my strength So then going into our first superset, this is a killer shoulder superset. We're going to be doing 10 lateral raises with a lighter weight. And then after that, we're going to be going into 10 single arm lateral raises, as you guys will see after this clip. I love doing shoulder supersets, literally so fire, guys. I can't even stress it enough to you guys. Um, but yeah, as you guys will see here, I am going to be starting to do my 10 um, single arm lateral raises, 10 on each arm, and I repeat this superset for a total of three times. Then moving into some upright rows, I've really been enjoying incorporating upright rows on the cable machine. I used to do them with a preloaded barbell, but I've really been enjoying the tension that the cable machine brings. So I'm doing about four sets of 10 to 12 reps at a light to moderate weight. So then we are going into our first tricep exercise. We're doing tricep push downs on the cable machine with the easy bar. We're going to be doing four sets of 10 reps. This is going to be a drop set. So doing our first 10 reps at a moderate rate, then dropping the weight to do 10 more reps at another lighter weight, repeating that for a total of four sets. And then going into our final superset, we're going to be doing 10 kneeling face pulls. I love these. These are great for targeting the rear delt. Sometimes I will hit rear delts on my back days, sometimes on my shoulder days. Just kind of depends what I'm feeling. So I'm doing 10 reps of shoulder or face pulls, sorry. Um, and then as you guys will see, I'm going to be going into my next shoulder exercise or my next tricep exercise, which is going to be overhead tricep extensions for 10 reps. I'm repeating this superset for a total of three times, so 10 reps for each exercise. <laughs> 